Hi friends, welcome to Easy and Home Style Cooking. I'm Mrs. Ragini. Today, I'm going to share one of the viewers, you know, they were asking like anything, why don't you show Kalmi Kebab? Today, I thought of sharing this Kalmi Kebab recipe with chicken. We are going to make this Kalmi Kebab nice and simple and little bit spicy. To make this Kalmi Kebab, we need the legs. That is the chicken legs. Usually, they use the thigh and the leg part so you can cut it like this or you know you can just get it like this today I'm using only the leg pieces like this if you want you can use the thigh and the leg joint but I want to make small small so I got only the leg pieces so first what I always do is first I marinate it my husband says you need to marinate it first and then the next day you need to add the masalas and again marinate it for another one or two hours so always I suggest get it in the morning and marinate with some ginger garlic paste and some lime juice and put it in the fridge in the evening if you want you can marinate the masalas and put it in the refrigerator and you can just remove and you know you can cook your kalmi kebabs so this is done I'm going to add some salt also very little first very little later on we can add some salt and mix this to the chicken and this marinade I suggest keep it for overnight or you know six hours so that your chicken will be nice and soft dear friends this chicken is already brined so I'm not going to marinate anymore so this is ready keep this aside and in another bowl we are going to add all the masalas so here is the coriander powder cardamom powder some pepper powder very little of turmeric and green chili paste and some cashew nut powder and also some shahi jeera so this what i'm going to do is i'm just going to crush it little bit and then add it friends i have just crushed it little bit add this and also finely chopped coriander and in this we are going to add hung yogurt you can add one tablespoon of hung yogurt and also some cream fresh cream mix this you can use a spoon or hand also no problem and I can add some salt if you brine your chicken then don't add too much salt otherwise your chicken will be salty and this is our marinade so friends this is ready to marinate with our chicken dear friends in the last we are going to add one egg yolk to bind our chicken so just one egg yolk you can add so friends just take one egg separate the egg yolk and the white I'm going to use the white also and the yellow yellow will be in the marinade and white I'm going to show you how we are going to make it this is done now the yellow part just add it and mix this also along with our mixture friends mix this either take your chicken and put it in this marinade or you know take the marinade and pour it on top of your chicken whichever way you want you can do it so that it will coat nicely now take the chicken pieces I'm going to put it in the bowl with this marinade if you want you can rest it for two hours and then you can saute this you will get it even more better kalmi kebabs so friends here our chicken is marinated I rested it for just one hour and this is all ready now here I have the egg white which I you know separated the egg and the white just take the white in a bowl or in a pasta plate or in a flat plate wherein you can you know dip our leg piece so just beat this and here the pan is also ready to shallow fry or you can do pan fry also this is all ready now here the pan is hot if you want you can shallow fry with butter olive oil regular oil anything I'm going to add some oil you know better than deep frying you can shallow fry it and once your oil is hot if you want you can first half cook the chicken then take the chicken dip it in the egg and then cook it again or otherwise directly from the marination put it in the egg and then you can cook it but this way what happens the egg cooks very fast and your chicken won't cook so what I'm going to do is first I'm going to half cook the chicken and then we are going to dip it in the egg so dip nicely with the marination put it with all the masala let the flame be slow 
otherwise the masala will cook fast and your chicken won't because we added yellow this is nicely sticking to the chicken and now in a very slow flame we are going to cook for 10 minutes if your chicken is nicely marinated this dish will be done in 10 to 15 minutes so since here you can see it took 10 to 15 minutes and I just covered it with a lid so that it cooks along with the moisture and you can see I was rotating in between and we got a nice excellent color and you can see the even the masala is nicely stick to our chicken and now what we are going to do is here is our egg white just take the leg piece put it in the egg white mixture just coat it and back to the pan take one more put it just coat it and back to the pan if you would have done this before your egg will cook fast your chicken won't so this is the best way once your chicken is 80 percent cooked then you can dip it in the egg white the last just coat it and cover this with a lid for another three to four minutes your dish will be ready so friends after three minutes our kalmi kebab is all ready to have this is only with the legs if you want you can cook along with the thigh just switch off the flame and remove the lid and serve it hot 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 and with this you can give some nice green chutney some salad beside and your dish will be thorough take one small piece you know if i'm going to have all my husband will kick me so dear friends this is one of my husband's favorite so i need to keep some of them for him so i'm just going to enjoy one hot hot fuming hot mm. because i marinated the chicken this is nice and soft and juicy 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 the way my husband likes it the egg is perfectly coated to this and even we added the yellow so that is also giving a nice you know little bit thick texture to our chicken you know leg pieces are not supposed to eat with the forks just take it you are supposed to have it like this if you like it dear friends you need to make this and this dish as i said couple of you know viewers were requesting to post it so i thought of sharing this recipe dear friends if you like it make this kalmi kebab and enjoy with your family and serve it nice and hot hot see you in another session with some more recipes but don't forget to share it and make it